Hi guys, so I know I've mentioned several times on this channel that I love vintage patterns and it's true. I love everything about them, the designs, the feel of them, and just everything. And so while I was snowed in this past week, I decided to make an apron using an advanced pattern from the late 40s to early 50s and I learned something new. And as you may recall, fabric used to come in 34 to 39 inches wide instead of the 45 to 60 inches that we have now. And so the cutting layouts had to be formatted for the smaller size fabric. And since I was using a 60 inch decorator fabric, I was paying little to no attention to the cutting layout until I noticed that I had one piece for the waistband tie of the apron. And I thought I was just supposed to cut two of them and then um, butt them up together and end up with one long strip. But I noticed that on all the directions, there was no center seam like I was going to end up with. There was two side seams and I could not figure out how they ended up with this. So I finally figured out, I looked at the layout and figured out what it meant. Um, the center edge was supposed to be placed on a fold and cut to the two dots that were on the pattern piece. Then the piece was supposed to be moved and cut two layers out from the two dots on the pattern to the other end of the pattern. This created three pieces, the one that was cut on a fold and then the two that were the rest of the piece. And so when you sew them all together, instead of having the center seam like I originally was going to have, you have the two side seams. And so your apron looks nice and finished and just much more professional than it would have. And so that was called piecing and it was something that I had never come across in a pattern before like that. And so I just wanted to share it with everyone else um, in case you come along something similar in a vintage pattern. And so the rest of this video is going to just be footage of me working on this apron and uh, I hope you enjoy it and I hope everyone's having a great weekend. See ya!